Okay, hi guys. Okay, see you for the new subtopic for the metallic bond. Okay, can you refer your textbook for the page, uh, page one three one uh, for the metallic bond. Okay, metallic bond. Okay, at the end of this chapter. Okay, at the end of this chapter, you will le uh, learn about the axon deformation and the reason. Uh, reason the electrical conductor conductivity of the metal okay okay actually okay in the metal okay the metal why the electrical wires made from the metal and can conduct electricity okay why the metal can conduct the electricity okay so the metal atoms okay the metal atoms here the metal atoms are arranged closely packed dia disusun secara uh, padat and orderly in the solid state orderly in solid state the valence electron so you know the metal for the valence electron okay for the example uh, magnesium okay magnesium 2.8.2 okay 2.8.2 so 2.8.2 so this is the valence electron for the magnesium 2 so this valence electron okay can be donated easily and delocalized delocalized ni maksudnya dia uh, duduk dalam satu tempat yang tidak uh, yang sekata ha yang mana delocalized electron means electron that move freely okay dia duduk secara bebas okay is not owned by the any by any atom or ion okay a sea of electron is formed when a valence shadow of the metal overlap okay resulting the electron delocalization so that's mean the metal ions that are positively charged are formed when valence electron are delocalized so bila metal atom metal atom ni mempunyai charge yang positif bila valence electron ni uh, bergerak secara uh, bebas so all the delocalized valence electron can move freely dia boleh bergerak secara bebas Okay, between the metal structure from a sea of electrons so nanti okay, in the structure of the metal okay, the structure of the metal they have a lot of the electrons here uh, uh, delocalized of electron so we call the sea of the electron so the electrostatic forces okay, between the sea electron and the positively charged metal ions form the metallic bond so maksudnya di sini the C, uh, po, uh, C electron and the positively charged here so it will form the metallic ok, dia akan form kat sini, uh, bersama-sama ni adalah sebagai metallic bond, ok metallic bond, ok, di sini kamu kena faham, ok, how the formation of the metallic bond Okay, when electron of metal atoms are delocalized, maksudnya dia bergerak bebas in the sea of the electron di dalam lautan elektron, the metal can conduct electricity. So bila dah ada elektron dia ada charge, so the charge so that means it can conduct the electricity. So electron move freely in the metal structure, carry the charge from the negative terminal to the positive terminal. So dia akan uh, membawa charge daripada negative terminal pergi ke positif terminal ok seperti dalam gambar ni ok so nanti itu sahaja untuk uh, metallic bond so di sini adalah untuk uh, learning account yang kedua ini adalah learning account yang pertama ini yang pertama ni learning account yang kedua so your work is to test yourself 5.6 in your uh, exercise book meaning of delocalize ok here have the me so the second is how the metallic bond is formed so in this explanation dia ada dah kau so second third using aluminium explain how metal can conduct electricity how the metal so you look at begini huh? dan explain dan explain so yeah and the your uh, exercise book and the simple note so uh, sampai situ sahaja untuk malam ni, okay, see you again. Okay guys, bye-bye.